Hi, class. Good evening. Now, can you listen to me? <laughs> I'm here, I'm here, okay? As I mentioned yesterday, como le dije ayer, siempre me tomo uno o dos minutos que estoy cambiando de clase, okay? But I'm here, don't worry, okay? I'm here. Okay. Thank you so much for being here. <laughs> well, I need to see your cameras on so I can see you. But let me listen. How are you today? How was your Tuesday? Was this a good Tuesday? A tiring Tuesday? A busy Tuesday? ¿Cómo estuvo su martes? Tell me. How was it? Yes, I want to listen to you. <laughs> Erica, how was your Tuesday? Uh, fine. Fine, okay. Acceptable. Good. Good. <laughs> Good. And how's the weather? How's the weather today? How's the weather? Este... Is it hot today? No, no. No? It's a little hot. Okay. It's little... raining. It's raining. Is it raining? Here. It's where, raining where, here. Where do you live, Rebecca? Santana. So imagine it's raining in yes. Santana. Wow. Yes. Who else lives in Santana? Nobody? Quien ma vive in Santana? Nobody? But it's raining too. But uh, later. Where do you live, Sandra? San Salvador. San Salvador. Is it raining? Really? Okay, I didn't know. I live in San Salvador as well, but I don't know if it's raining. So, thank you so much for joining the class. I guess it's time to start. And last class, we were talking about a topic. We didn't have like that much time to finish with this topic, but let me see if you remember vocabulary. Vocabulary. We were talking about this vocabulary. There we go. Transportation in the US and transportation in El Salvador. So we were talking about these pictures, this vocabulary. So what do you remember? Number one, how do you get to work? How do you get to work? Number one class, this is for everybody. It's time to participate. Class, wait, let me check. Será que solo yo estoy en la clase? Come on class, I need everybody to speak, okay? Not only Rebecca and Jennifer, everybody's in the class okay don't be afraid to participate remember that we only have one hour una hora para participar yo ahí nos enfocamos en otras cosas y menos en el español oh don't worry cristelia gracias por dejarme saber casi no escucha bien porque está lloviendo oh imagine gracias bien so vocabulary number one how do you get to work how do you get to work number one drive but we were using an expression se acuerdan de la expresión que usábamos ayer how do you get to work you know by, uh, by, by. drive muy bien clase by by in this case number one by driving so how do we read the rest of the information number two how do you get to work by walking. By driving. By walking. Number three. By take, taking the bus. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Taking the bus. By taking the bus. Number four. By taking the subway. By taking the subway. Number five. By taking the train. By, by taking the train. Number six. By ride, riding a bike. By riding a bike. Number seven. By riding a motorcycle. 
by riding a motorcycle or what is another way to say motorcycle? Bike. Bike, Bike. excellent. And number eight, how do you get to work? Look at number eight. By taking a taxi or by taking a car? Okay, by taking a taxi, by taking a car. How about you? How do you get to work? How do you get to work? Yes, class. By driving? By, by taking, yes, Ana Maria. Taking yep. a bus. By taking a bus. Okay, so this was the vocabulary. Vamos a pasar la lista ahorita, ¿sí ya? Después de esa introducción. Me dicen here or present. What day is it today? Who can tell me the date? Today is... Mon uh, Tuesday. Monday, Tuesday. No? Yes. Yeah. Tuesday. Yeah. March. 15. 2022. 2022. Okay. Adriana González. Present. Present. Okay. Ana Karina. Okay. Ana María. Present. Excellent. Carlos Alberto Cabrera. I'm sorry, teacher. No sé si será Cabrera o Villalobos. O habrá otro Carlos Alberto. You know, I have two Carlos Alberto. Tengo dos Carlos Alberto. So, in this case, okay. Cabrera. Cabrera. Okay, now here. Carlos Alberto Villalobos. I'm here. Carlos, ¿estuvo en la clase ayer? No, no, dije. No, right? Ah, no entonces pude. ahora el otro Carlos no lo veo en la clase. ¿Qué pasa con estos Carlos? Chicos, conectémonos siempre tiempo. Cristian Adonai Ramírez. Here, teacher. Excellent. Cristelia Jiménez. Here, teacher. Very good. Cristian Alberto Reyes. Okay, Edgar Francisco. Edgar Isaac. Present teacher. Very good. Eric Hernandez. Present teacher. Thank you. Jennifer Hernandez. Present. Okay. Joaquín Chévez. Okay. Joana Beatriz Rivas. Present. Okay. Jorge Alberto Hernández. Present. Okay. José Armando Hernández. Present teacher. Very good. Juana Beatriz. Present. Eh, ¿Estuvo ayer en la clase, Juana? Sí, estuve, pero tuve un inconveniente. A mi hija le dio un paro respiratorio, entonces me tuve que ir de emergencia para el hospital y ya no pude seguir con la clase. Ah, ok, sí, porque veo acá solo 14 minutos. Ok, pero bienvenida, bienvenida. Aquí estamos ahora, ok. Catherine Larisa. Present teacher. Very good. Kevin Alexander. Okay. Oh, okay, okay. Marlon Ovidio. Present. Excellent. Rebecca Abigail. Present teacher. Excellent. René Eduardo. Okay. Roxana Beatriz. Samuel Eduardo. 
Present. Present, Roxana. Oh, Roxana. Thank you, Roxana. Eh, Sandra Cecilia. Present. And Yesenia Claribel. Present teacher. Okay, so I'm just missing. Let me check a little bit quick. Ana Karina, Carlos Alberto Cabrera, Cristian Alberto Reyes, Edgar Francisco. Aha, you say present. Cristian, there you are. Gracias, Cristian. Yo no estuve en la clase de ayer. Ok. Yes, aquí veo que no estuvo. ¿Algún inconveniente? Nada más que la clase que dio. Okay. En verdad, Yesenia no la tengo en mi lista ya. So, let's start with the class right now. For today we have, you know, a some more practice. Don't forget to have your cameras on all the time and to write your full name. Se nos indicaban en el chat de WhatsApp, siempre chequenlo, ¿ok? Nombre completo siempre, porque cuando se descarga la asistencia de Zoom, necesita aparecer los cuatro, eh, bueno, dos nombres, dos apellidos, ¿ok? Así que, para que no haya confusión, recordemos que hay muchos eh, estudiantes y en este grupo se repiten, por ejemplo, hay dos Carlos y hay dos Creo que hay dos Cristian, entonces se repite, ¿ok? Así que nombre completo siempre, para que no haya inconveniente a la hora de trasladar la asistencia diaria. Bien, no more Spanish in this class. We will practice in this. Listen, I need you to go check the platform and practice this conversation. We have an audio and a video, so you can listen and practice this conversation. Go and check the conversation and practice, okay? This is related to transportation. And the first topic for today, but let me stop sharing this one. You already saw the topic, family members. If I ask you, mention the family members that you remember or what comes to your mind when I say family member. ¿Qué viene a su mente cuando digo family members? Go ahead, class. Veamos. Family members. My, my family. Uh -huh. My fathers. My father. Daughters. My daughter, sisters. Sister. Yes, everybody. My father and grandmother. Uh -huh. Father, grandmother. Yes, Rebecca, go ahead. Uh -huh. Rebecca. Uh -huh. Yes, este. My mother, my father, uh -huh. uh, my sister, my brother. Okay, your brother, Jorge. Family members. Thank you, Rebecca. Uh -huh. Father-in-law, mother-in-law, uh, aunt. Okay. Uh, sister, brother, son. Uh, wow. Yeah. Excellent. Carlos Alberto. Aunt. Give me some other examples. Uh, grandmother. Okay. Grandfather. Okay. That's it. And we have so many others. So now you can take a look at this vocabulary. Family members. I have a list right here. I took this list from a book and it's very interesting, you know? Look, we have mother and mom. So which one do you use or which one is uh, more common in El Salvador? Do you use mother or mom? ¿Qué usamos nosotros, chicos? Mother or mom? Mom. Mother. Mom, mom right? Le decimos madre o mamá mm -hmm. o mami a nuestra mamá. Mom. Mom, mom. right? It's mom. exactly so. It's mommy. very formal if we say, okay, this is my mother. Yes. Es mi madre, es mi padre. Tal vez lo usamos, pero es más común mom and dad. Okay, mother, mom. And then we have father. And what is the, uh, another way to say father in English? Mm -hmm. 
father or dad. Oh, it's right here. Dad. Very good. But we also have mother in law and father in law. So, what is the meaning of this one? Mother in law, father in law. Any idea? Abuela and abuelo. Mm, are you sure, class? Is la, this el, how? El padrastro o la madrastra. Uh -huh, madrastra. Uh -huh. Not really. No, no solo no. Los, los, papás de, los papás de su, los los papás de su pareja. Pero there you go. There you go. Suegros. Suegros. Mm. Mother-in-law. Do you love your mother-in-law and your father-in-law? Yes. Do you love them? Yes. No. Yes, right? <laughs> or no, no, no. Maybe the other way. Do they love you? Yes. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe, right? We don't know. We don't know. Si los aman a ustedes o ustedes los aman a ellos. Bueno, no sabemos. Okay? I, don't, I don't have. <laughs> oh, I don't have. You're a lucky girl. You're a lucky girl. Yeah, in my case, yes, I like them. I love them. Okay, that's it. Mother-in-law, father-in-law. Okay? And then we have partner. Look at this. This one, Part, uh -oh. wait, Little. partner, this one. What is the meaning of this one, partner? Partner, compañero. Okay, it can be for a girl or for a boy, okay? He's my partner, she is my partner, okay, mi compañero. Maybe because we are going, uh, when we are not married, cuando no se está casado, mi pareja, okay. Um, Look at this one, parent, parent. What is this? Parientes. Okay, padre. 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 Ah, padre. Um, who say pariente? Pariente sería como la traducción más aceptable. It can be uh, singular and plural, okay? Parent, parent. Mi pariente. Parent, yes, parent. Very good. No es papá, okay? And we have okay, children. Thank you. Children. Niños. It's plural. Oh, yeah. What is the exactly? What is the singular form of saying children? So, hmm? child. Kids. Child. Uh -huh. It can be child or kids. Mm. Singular, child, plural, children. Mis mm -hmm. uh -huh. niños, niños, okay? Y ahí estamos haciendo referencia. Ambos, niñas y niños, okay? My children, uncle, niño. Ah, yeah. Exactly. I need yeah. you to help tío. me out. Uncle, tío. Uncle, tío, niece. Sobrina. Mm -hmm, exactly. Y nephew. Ah, sobrina. So, you know, so, which one is for girls and which one is for boys? Is niece for girls or for boys? Girls. Girls. Nephew, is this for girls or for boys? Boys. Ah, boys. Okay. Yeah, that is the difference. Niece, nephew, grandson, grandson. Daughter, exactly. Do you have grandsons or granddaughters already? No? No. No, right? We are young. Todavía estamos jóvenes, dicen. No, but you know. No tanto, pero no tengo todavía nietos. No, todavía no. Okay? So, grandson, granddaughter, nieto, nieta. And we have this category. Look singular grandchild so what is the meaning of grandchild nietos ah pero ese no es plural es singular sería entonces nieto 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 and how do we say nietos in english grandchildren excellent excellent nieto sería entonces Grand, 
children, plural, okay? Grandchild, it's only one. Grandchildren, more than two, okay? That is the difference. Grandchild, grandchildren. Okay, let's read. Um, let me see, Jose Armando, can you help me out? Jose Armando, can you read this one? Up to here. Read, please. Read. What is there? Okay. Yeah. Well, excellent. Thank you, Jose Armando. Aunt. What is aunt? Tia. Tia. ¿Y tío cómo era? Uncle. Uncle. Uncle, aunt. Uncle is for men. Aunt is for. Woman. Woman, exactly. Then we have cousin. What is cousin? Prima. Okay. Husband. Husband. Esposo. 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 Wife. Wife. Esposa. 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 Hey, look at this one. Well, I didn't know about this one. Is this a family member? <laughs> Ex, ok, it's included, oh, ya lo incluyen, sí. imagínense, no, darle mucha importancia. Bueno, pero aquí está, ex, your ex, ex. it can be for girls and for boys, ok. It was my family member, but not anymore, ok, my ex, ok. Imagínense, ya los incluyen, bien. Son, daughter, Hijo. hija, muy bien. Hijo. Sister, hija. Ajá. sister and brother. Hermano. Uh, and we hermana, have hermano. grandmother, grandfather, and grandparent, grandmother. Abuelo, abuelo. Uh -huh. Muy bien, miren, ambos inician con grand, lo mismo que los nietos, ok? Grandmother, grandfather, y la categoría para decir abuelo, grandparent. Grandson, granddaughter, grandchild. Bien. And the last one, last information, this one, the, the one in red. Uh, Jennifer, can you help me out reading the red box? Sister, sister in law, brother in law, stepmother, stepfather. Oh, okay. Once again, we have in law. In law, we have mother in law, father cuñado. in law, cuñado, okay, we have cuñado, in law, cuñado, cuñada, brother in law, ajá, cuñado, cuñada, suegro, suegra. Suegra. Y vean esto, la forma de escribirla es entre los guiones, los separamos, in law, ¿ok? Escribámoslo siempre así, ¿ok? Sister in law, ¿ok? Sister in law. Very good. And we have stepmother, stepfather, stepmother, stepfather. What is this? Step. Any idea? Stepmother, stepfather. I know somebody now. Padrastro, madrastro. Muy bien. Yo sé que más de alguno sabía. Padrastro, madras. Okay. So, como decimos entonces, hijastro, hijastra. Step. Step. Step sister. Uh -huh. Step brother. Brother. Hijastro, mm. hijastra. No, eso sería hermanastro, hermanastra. Mm. Step. Step down. Step down. Step down. Muy bien, solo le agregamos son, si queremos que sea hijo, o le agregamos daughter if we want it to be a girl ajá, hijo, hija step, step so step mother madras 
stepfather, padrastro, stepdaughter, que sería eso, y hatra, stepson, stepbrother, mi hermanastro, stepsister. Look, we have so many members using step. Stepdaughter, stepson, stepbrother, stepsister. Wow, that's a big list. Wow, a big list. A lot of family members, okay? So don't forget to practice. And I have a picture right here. Look at this beautiful family. They are all smiling. Oh, this is a smiling family. Who are they? For example, who is this man in this picture? What can you tell me about him? Who is this man? Dad. dad. Yes. Oh, he can be dad. What else? Oh, dad. Father. Oh, father. father. It can be dad, father. Yeah. ¿Qué más es? Esposo? How do we say esposo? Husband. 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 Very good. Very good job. How about this woman? Mother. Mother. Mom. Wife. Mom. Wife. Wife. Excellent. Wife. And then we have one, two, three kids. Who are they? Who is this boy? Who is son. the boy? He's a son or brother or brother. Sister. Simply. And this girl is a daughter sister. or daughter. Sister. 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 Muy bien. And this other boy. Who is this boy? Son. Son or brother. Or brother. Very good. Okay, so let's repeat. Mother. Mother. Mom. Mother. Mother. Mom. 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 Mother. Father. Father. Mother in law. Mother in law. Mother in law. Father in law. Father in law. Partner. Partner. Dad. 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 Parent. 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 Children. 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 Uncle. 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 Niece. 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 Nephew. 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 Grandson. Grandson. Granddaughter. Granddaughter. Grandchild. Grandchild. Excellent. Aunt. 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 Cousin. 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 Husband. Husband. Why? Why? Ex. Son. Son. Daughter. Daughter. Sister. Sister. Brother. 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 Grandmother. Grandmother. Grand okay, grandfather. Grandfather. Grandparent. Grandparent. Sister-in-law. Sister in, -law. in -law. Brother in law. Brother in law. Stepmother. 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 And stepfather. Stepfather. Very good job. So let me see. Rebecca, tell me a number from one to ten. Okay. Repeat. Tell me a number from one to ten. Uh, one, two, 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, now pick one number. Escoge un número de todos estos. Pick a number. Five. Bien, five. Who is number five in my list? One, two, three, four, five. Carlos Alberto. Carlos Alberto. Villalobos, teacher. Ah, yes, Villalobos. I forget. Olvido que tengo dos. Yes, Carlos Alberto Villalobos. Tell me five words from the vocabulary. Five words from the vocabulary. Father. Okay. Uncle. Okay. Son. Okay. And mother. Okay. And stepmother. And stepmother. Now, Carlos, choose a volunteer. Elige un voluntario. Jennifer. Jennifer, excellent, thank you. Tell me five more and don't repeat. Uh, <laughs> children. Okay. Husband. Okay. Wife. Okay. Daughter. Mm -hmm. And son. And son. Now, Jennifer, pick another volunteer. A boy, please. A boy, not girl. Boy. Uh, Christian. Christian. Where are you, Christian? Okay, Christian. Christian Adonai. Christian Adonai, tell me five more. Five more examples of family members. Uncle, cousin, grandfather, grandmother, and sister. And sister, okay, uncle. So, Christian, pick a girl, a volunteer, a girl, not boy, girl. Eh, Adriana, Gretel. Adriana, thank you. Adriana, tell me five more. Um, sister in love, brother in love, eh, uncle, eh, nephews. Um, X. X, okay. Very good job. Let me see. Okay. Tengo problemas con mi internet. Okay. Don't forget to have your cameras on. Si no, vamos a hacer participar a los de las cámaras apagadas. So what are we going to do with these family members? We have this topic for today apart from this one we have this look what do we have here this is taken from the book okay we have a family and a small family okay <clears throat> paul and jason and emily they are a family so take a look at paul's information paul is husband and father Help me out with and information. ¿Qué pueden decirme de and? She is? Wife and mother. Ah, muy bien. Wife. She is wife and? Mother. 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 And they both, ambos son? Parents. 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 Bien. Tell me the information about Jason. Jason is? Brother. Brother or son. 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 How about Emily? Emily is a sister. Sister. And daughter. And daughter. Y ambos, Jason and Emily, are children. Children. Muy bien. So. Once again, para que nos quede claro, who is Paul? Paul is husband, 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 father, or father. father, father, muy bien, and is mother, mother, or mother, but wife, or wife, Jason is brother. brother. Or son. Son. son, son, and Emily's sister, sister, sister. or 
daughters. And both, they are children. 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 So, I have questions about this one. Look at this exercise. In number one, we have an is Paul's wife. wife. One more time. An is Paul's is Paul. Wife. Right. Wife. Very good. Wife. Very good. So, what are we going to do? We are going to work in groups right now. I'm going to send this picture to WhatsApp. Don't forget to check WhatsApp, okay? Check WhatsApp. I'm going to send this picture and we are going to answer this one. ¿Qué vamos a responder? Estos son how many? Eight. Estos ocho ejercicios. Eight exercises. Eight questions about this family. Is it clear? Is it clear what we're going to do? Yes, no? Si esta claro lo que vamos a hacer? Mm -hmm. yes. yes. Yes, okay, so mm -hmm. give me a second. Tenemos so que I... realizar uh -huh. ese ejercicio y enviarlos al WhatsApp. No, van a trabajarlos en okay. su cuaderno y vamos a trabajar en grupos, okay? It's just speaking practice, speaking. Como salas. Yes, en las salas, muy bien. Okay. Teacher. Yes, tell me. Okay. Um, yo no tengo, no tengo el libro, o sea, no tengo ahorita material. Pero, o sea, lo puedo hacer en el cuaderno, aunque este es un poco más difícil. Sí, hagámoslo en el cuaderno. Son solo ocho ejercicios. Uh -huh. eh, did you check uh -huh. WhatsApp? ¿Ya recibieron la picture en WhatsApp? Yes. No. no. Yo solo le tomé yes. captura. No, okay. yet. Yes. yes, I send it to yes. WhatsApp. You can check WhatsApp. And let's create the groups. Here we go. Don't forget to say hi to your classmate. Tell me, Carlos. Yes, Carlos. Sir, excuse me. Este, eh, yo en el grupo creo que todavía no he ingresado. No estuve el día de ayer. Creo que han hecho un grupo de WhatsApp. Uh, ahorita le comparto el enlace. ¿Ok? Ahorita. Teacher, yo tampoco estoy en ese grupo de WhatsApp. Exacto. No, ni yo tampoco. Ok, ok, ok. Don't worry. Ahorita mismo y vuelvo a enviar la imagen. Ok, don't worry. Hola, so... hola, hola, buenas noches. Yo igual no estoy en el grupo de WhatsApp. Ok, here we go. So, give me a second. Aquí vamos, se los paso en un minutito. Here we go. This is group number two. Grupo dos, de nueve a diez, ¿verdad? Vamos. I don't know if it's me. No sé si solo soy yo, chicos, o también se escucha como interferencia. Hay una interferencia. ¿Verdad? Yo pensé que era yo. Sí. No, ah, se okay. escucha algo raro. ¿Y ahora? Bueno, no sé qué era. Bien, check WhatsApp. Miren WhatsApp. That is the link. Ese es el enlace. Well, let me check. Double check. Yes, that's the correct one. You can click there. And it's going to eh, take you to WhatsApp group. Ese les va a ayudar para que se unan al grupo de WhatsApp. ¿Bien? Mm, yo no veo nada. No, no estoy Está en, el en el chat. En el chat de WhatsApp, perdón, en el chat de Zoom se los acabo de enviar. ¿sí? Ah, en el chat, perdón. En el chat de Zoom. Aquí está. Pueden verlo. Carlos, Ana María. Pero voy a esperar yes. ahorita. Sí, está en el grupo de WhatsApp. Bien, ok, so let's go. Uh, sí. Ahorita les comparto nuevamente la imagen, ok. En WhatsApp. So, there we go. Very good. The picture mm -hmm. is there. Muy bien. Aquí vamos. The picture again. Mm -hmm. Five minutes. You have five minutes to work in groups. Ah, muy poquito tiempo. No, because it's so easy and we are seven. <laughs> Somos cuatro en cada grupo, ok? No, vamos a crear five participants in each group. Here we go. You can join right now. Here we go. Excellent. Very good. There you go. Uh, 
How about you guys? Ah, there you go. Okay. Ya tienen la notificación para unirse al grupo. Sí, ya me uní, es dicho. Ah, pero ahorita estamos en grupos de trabajo aquí en Zoom. Ah, perdón. Ahorita ah, estaba viendo yo lo del, lo del grupo de WhatsApp. Ah, ok, ok, ok. Uh -huh. I'm missing Christian Alberto. Eh, ahí vamos. Muy bien. Go class, go. José Armando, Roxana, Marlon, Edgar y Christian. Did you have problems, Marlon? Ah, no, there you go. Excellent. Christian, José y Roxana. Very good. So, José Armando y Christian only. Okay. Eso es lo que lo que aparece en el en imagen. Jason uh, and Emily are there y aparece la la línea, ¿verdad? Entonces ahí puede, ahí tendría que ser children, ¿verdad? Yes, ¿Qué palabra that's... tendría que ser? ¿Me dijiste? Children. children. Estamos hablando de Jason and Emily are they children? Es en el 2. En el 3. Children. Children, children. En el 3, la oración. Que han en Paul son los esposos, ¿verdad? ¿Mande? Eh, ellos son los esposos, ¿verdad? Entonces Jason y Emily son los hijos, ¿verdad? Ajá. Entonces sí, serían. Están preguntando los... que Jason children. y Emily. Ajá, que son. Children. Son sus. Ajá, sus. Sus hijos. hijos. Pero ¿Cómo se escribe hijos? Ajá, you don't remember. Children. Try to children. practice your English, okay? Try to practice. How do you say hijos in English? Or how do you write hijos in English, okay? Practice your English. Okay? How do you write? write? Excellent. <laughs> la, la tres lleva el apóstrofe de posesión. Sería que es Ana de Paul. Ahí sí oh. sería parent. Sí, ¿verdad? 7858. 5858. ¿Did you finish? No, no, no. Okay, what are you doing? 7858. <laughs> Come on, class, you're supposed to be working in that exercise. <laughs> okay. Es que no, no le cayó la imagen a Jorge. Dice. A Jorge ah, no really? le cayó. Estamos haciendo, sí, entonces, oh, eso es okay. raro. Why not, Jorge? You're not in WhatsApp. I don't know. Pero está en el grupo, dice, y no, no oh, le aparece really? la imagen. That's weird, okay. So, thank Pero, you. Gracias, Jennifer, por ayudarme. Ahí. Oh, brother. Can you... The image I can. No sé si la puede compartir. Take a, pero... a photo. Okay. Ajá, tal vez I'm le puede compartir la imagen. Here we go. Pero eh, no entiendo. Yo no entiendo qué es lo que vamos a hacer exactamente. Okay, look, we have eight questions. Tenemos ocho. No preguntas en sí, pero oraciones incompletas. Incompletas. No, no, no. Do you have it, Jorge? Yes, I have it. Very good job. I so, can see it. Uh, okay. Now you can see it. You took the, the screenshot. Very good. So, keep on going. Is it clear? Is the instruction clear? We are going to complete sentences using um, families information. Okay? Yes, I'm clear. Very good. Help each other. Ayúdense entre todos, okay? Very good. Hello, girls. Did you finish? Yes. You did? Yes. Okay, was this easy or difficult? 
How was it, Sandra? Easy. The boat. Uh -huh, the activity. A little. A little. Okay. Where is Yesenia? Yesenia. Where are you, Yesenia? <laughs> Yesenia is not there. Okay. So, Sandra, let me take you. Well, I'm just missing one group and then we come back to the main session. Okay. Vamos al salón principal. To finish. Where are you guys? Yeah, I do finish. Where are your cameras? Are you sleeping? Are you eating right now? Or are you practicing your English? No, exactly. <laughs> I... <laughs> uh -huh, I catch it. I got it. I need I need to be honest. So <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for your honesty. Don't forget to practice. This is idea for groups, okay? So you can interact with your classmates. Yeah, Listen to I your know. Groups, okay. So did you finish? So I, yeah, I have the question. So um, I need into um, a different evolution because um, the five months ago, I started at the first CC. So I, I started at around six and five months so i achieve um a different level for example yeah. uh, intermediate so yes um, because this is basic still this is still basic yeah i know that the problem is i i don't i don't have a um, another team or another group for example intermediate um but i need to start because i think that i lost my time so I know that this is easy, but I need to more. Um, yeah, I know. So why don't you talk to people uh, directly from uh, this academy and tell them, look, I'm looking for something else. I need to, uh, to be part of another group, okay? Yes, yeah, I know. You can so I, I, I know that this is important to pass to for a week. So, um i remember that another girl say me um when they finish the class or they finish this team on the, this for a week so i um i i try to to pass a, a different level ah, okay but let me ask you about that and i'm going to have an answer tomorrow okay how yeah, we I... can do it okay so don't worry okay. Did you finish, guys? Did you finish the exercise? Yeah. You did. Okay, so let's go back to the main station. Sí, como ahí mandó a el, ella el, el... Did you practice? El, la, la, la hojita esa. Pero ahorita creo que estamos regresando. Yes, we're coming back right now. Because of sí, the time. Okay, Hi. here we go. We're coming back. How was this exercise? Easy, difficult? How was it? Only me? Mm -hmm. How was what? This exercise, this topic, um, how was it? Okay, children is the second. Okay, but wait, wait, yeah. wait, wait. Don't give me the answer. Wait, wait, wait. We're waiting for your classmates. Where are they? I don't, I don't know. So I know. Okay. I, I think that only, only me. <laughs> no, they're coming back. They're coming back. Here we go. I am here. I am okay. here. Very good. I can see you now. So here we go. Number one. Number one. Let me see. Jose Armando. Number one. Read the complete sentence. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. Anna is for wife. Class, is that the correct information? Yeah. Yes, yes right, yeah. it's right there. Excellent job. Uh, Eric, Eric, number two is for you. Number two. Um, Jason and Emily are there. His children. 
Is that correct, class? Is that the correct information? Yes. Yes. No. Yes. Very good. Uh, Sandra, go ahead with number three. Paul is an husband. Is that correct? Yes. Yes. Oh, wow. Excellent yes. job. Marlon, go ahead and continue. Which one? Number four. Um, I'm sorry. Um, Jason and Annie is a uh, um, song. I'm it's, sorry. Nah, nah, I got huh? you. It's not that one. Jason, is that correct? One? Is Annie? Yes. Yeah. Yes. yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I got confused. Yeah, excellent. I'm sorry. Excellent oh. job. <laughs> Jennifer, Jennifer, number five. Emily. Is Paul daughter? Emily is Paul's daughter. 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 Yeah, that's correct. Daughter. Adriana. Adriana number seven. Jason is Emily. Brother. Emily's Jason is Emily's. Emily's. Emily's brother. Very good. Joaquin. Eight. The last one is for Seven. you. Joaquin Antonio. The last one is for you. Okay. Me? Yeah, maybe he's not listening. Who's that? Me, me, teacher. But tell me your name, Ana Maria. Me, teacher. Okay, okay, Ana Maria, go. Seven. Eight. Ah, uh, eight. Paul mm -hmm. and Anne are Jason's parents. Paul and Anne are Jason's parents. Parents. Is that correct? Parents. Okay. Is it correct? Yes or no? Yes. Yes, yes, it is. Yes. So how do we go to this uh, part of grammar? What is this topic about? We call it the apostrophe S or the possessive. Possessive. What comes to your mind if you read this word possessive? Possessive. What is possessive? Yes. My, my, your, their, his, all. Okay. Pero esos son pronombres, pero en este caso case, possessive case. Es esto, miren, the apostrophe is or the apostrophe only. El apostrophe es apostrophe, okay? So this is just, I don't know if you cover this topic Last uh, for, like, for, uh, for example, uh, tell me. For example, when do you wanna um, um, short um, uh, the phrase? For example, it is. So you can use an apostrophe. So you can erase uh, it, mm -hmm. and um, and you you say it is. So you only say s apostrophe at it e e i it at. Okay, but don't confuse, please. Don't confuse. Mm -mm, not really, you know, because this is just to make it short. But the apostrophe, or in this case, the possessive case, también lleva un apostrophe, pero esto nos indica posesión, possessive. Por eso ahí viene la palabra possessive, porque pertenencia, posesivo. Algo le pertenece a alguien. So, for example, we were talking about Paul and this girl, this woman. Si usamos dos nombres, las reglas se las voy a poner fácil. Al último, to the last one, el último va a llevar el posesivo solamente. In the case that we are talking about just one person, we are going to add the apostrophe S. 
at the end. If we have a name that ends in S, we can do this. Have it like this, just with the apostrophe, or we can also have this one. The apostrophe, N and S. But it's not so common. I prefer to use only the apostrophe, okay? Paul and Anas, Anas and Carlos, Carlos, okay? So for example, here in El Salvador, we use this uh, apostrophe or possessive case a lot, the possessive case. Usamos bastante el possessive case. For example, have you ever seen uh, the beauty salons or the barber shops? Because they call it in that way. Siempre usan el possessive case. For example, digamos que se llama Fernanda's Salon. ¿Qué significa entonces Fernanda's Salon? ¿Qué significa esa expresión? ¿Cuál es el término? El salón de Fernanda. El salón de Fernanda. El salón de Fernanda. What if I want to say, yo quiero decir que de Carlos y de Fernanda, ese salón, ¿cómo lo hago? Carlos y Fernanda. Carlos y Fernanda. Fernanda. Salón. 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 Like this one, salón. Carlos and Fernanda. No. Is no, that correct? No. Why no. not? Why not? Because we are just going to add the possessive at the end to the second name. If I had three names, the same rule. If I have four names, the same rule, just at the end. So I'm sorry, Carla. Carlos, I'm sorry. So Fernanda. <laughs> Carlos and Fernanda's salon. Let's say that they have a salon. Okay. Perdón, no comprendí eh, en el caso que el final lleve ese el nombre. Siempre uh -huh. se le coloca el apóstrofe y la S. Hay dos formas de ponerlo. Solo el apóstrofe uh -huh. después de la S o podemos poner apóstrofe S. Pero lo más común uh -huh. es solo el apóstrofe. Aunque está correcto okay. también hacerlo. Apóstrofe S. Okay. Questions about okay. this. Questions about Pero possessive case. Caso, eh, sorry. En ese caso es cuando termina con ese el nombre o, o como no, no me quedó no, claro. En ese caso sí, solo cuando es ese, cuando termina en ese. Por eso les decía Carlos. Ya, ahí sí podemos usar solo el apóstrofe o solo el apóstrofe ese. Si sí, el nombre, por ejemplo, Paul, este no termina en ese. Entonces, uh -huh. ¿cuál es nuestra regla? No Pose. podemos hacer esto. No, es uh -huh. Paul. Pose. Ahí sí. Okay. Díganme otro nombre que termine en ese. Luis. Muy bien. Luis. Puede ser Luis. O también podemos hacerlo. Luis. Luis. Okay. Both is okay. Uh -huh. Okay. So... I need you to go and check the platform. Go and check the topics, the platform. You can check the information there. And questions about this. Pregunta, chicos, está claro? Comentarios? Yes, no? My camera is blurry. So we are just going to do something. I'm going to take a screenshot every day. Acuérdenme, si se me olvida de tomar el screenshot, siempre teacher, se nos olvidó el screenshot, para que quede evidencia, si estuvieron en la clase, y que quede una imagen, y no solo en la asistencia, ok? So, three, two, and one, smile, three, two, and one, smile. Ok, Ana María, enciende su cámara, gracias. One, two, and three. Bien, so, si no hay más preguntas, nos vemos cuando. Tomorrow. 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 What time? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Tomorrow at night. 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 At night
Si no hay más preguntas. Thank you so much. Have a great night. And good night. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. Good night. Bye bye. I have a piece. I have a patient. Yes. So, for example, with the with the with the